Let's unbox all the stuff that I picked up during the Sephora sale that I probably didn't need, but technically I did need. Let's go. I realized that I did not do a recommendation video and I didn't do one because I have so many videos to, to film and also Y'all know the, the fall winter one, that's that's when I really shine. So I kind of treat the spring one as re-ups and I just didn't want to sit here and talk about the same ish I always talk about. But uh, yeah, I picked up some stuff, some is new, some, some things are new. So I was like, okay, let's just at least show you what I got, how rude of me. But if you're new here, Hey, I'm Chi Chi and I talk about all things lavish, but logical. So if that's your sort of thing, go ahead, subscribe, make some friends in the comment section and follow me on Instagram and TikTok. Not a lot of things in here. Um, you know what, let me put the box on this tissue paper because y'all know how I feel. Actually, you know what, let me empty the box. <laughs> She's smart. Uh, let's talk about some regular stuff that I always get. So facial cotton squares. Shiseido, these are my absolute favorite. They just feel so nice. A lot of my skincare items, I usually use my hands, but when I actually do need a cotton pad, these are the best. These are the best. They're like the softest I've ever felt, and it's, it's for me. I think for the most part, everything is like makeup y. Uh, no, I'm lying. Kiehl's, they're ultra. What is this, ultra facial cream? I got the refillable hat. Refillable? Listen, I worked an eight hour shift. I drove an hour one way, an hour back. I'm, I'm tired, I'm doing this after work. So if the words don't come out right, oh well. <laughs> That's why I ain't got no makeup on. You want a full beat or what I got? Make the decision. Anywho, I got this. Um, I really do like Kiehl's. I meant to get this during Kiehl's website like sale. I think it was 30% off, 25 or 30% off. And I completely just forgot to make my order. So I was just like 20% is better than no percent. So this thing is expensive though for a refill pouch. I was like, girl, why is it so much? But it is what it is. Body care. Okay, this is new. So. I think I showed you guys that I picked up like some honey products, maybe last year or the year before. So they just released a body oil and I've told you I'm a baddie with my body oils right now. <laughs> so um, I wanted to give this a try. I never actually did a full review of their items, but maybe since I have the body oil now, if you know, it's requested, you know, I only need one person to quest something and then I'm gonna do it. I don't know why opening boxes for me is always an, like an experience, but this is their um, their packaging. They do have, come on camera, you on the clock. <laughs> this is their packaging. They do have the pump inside here, so don't just throw away your, your box uh, without taking out your pump, but there's really no smell to this. It says the touchable anti-oil. So I was just a little curious about their, their oil, but we'll see how this goes. You know, it was something different. I saw that they, it had just released and honestly, that's the only reason why it, it made it into my cart. But we'll, we'll see how I rock with this one. Let's go with the uh, perfume. Yeah, let's do perfume. Not a lot of perfume, guys. <laughs> Honestly, it was just the one. I got the uh, Ness Lychee Rose. Stop focusing on me. You worried about the wrong thing, camera. <laughs> the Ness Lychee Rose. Every time I went to Sephora, I really, really enjoyed smelling this. So I was like, this year, we're just gonna pick up Travels and hope for the best. And if it gets upgraded, then boom, for the winter time, maybe I'll get a full size bottle. So that was my thought process when getting this. But every time I smell it, I really like it. <sighs> to me, this has the most realistic lychee smell. 
than most of the lychee fragrances that I have tried. I smell the actual fruit that's in your lychee martini. <laughs> yeah, so I really liked it. I'm gonna mess with this little travel size, see how she likes it and move on from there. Everybody been talking about this topicals lip balm. I talked about topicals quite a while ago when they were first, you know, brand new. And now everybody getting hip to, you know, being a part of the dip set, you know, you gotta get your lips wet. So we're gonna talk about their lip balm. This is the applicator, it's kind of cool, you know. Camera, you ain't do anything today. You should be on point. <laughs> so the little curve is minty. Oh, it doesn't glide that well, hold on. I just had a, a, I just got triggered. This reminded me of something from my childhood. Oh my God. It's something about the mint. It's something about the mint. Oh my God. <laughs> 2.5 seconds I went back to my childhood school. Okay. Hmm. Well, anywho. This, the reason why I really wanted to try this one because it has ceramides in it. Ceramides, if you want your, your stuff to really be locked in, ceramides. So it also has hyaluronic acid, glycerin, and rice bran wax. I don't know what that is. But I hear a lot of good things. It's minty. Something about this mint triggers. Triggers. But I'm here for it. It's all right. A little thick. It's cool. Like, I'm gonna use it as a treatment. Regular re-up on the, the Duo Lash Glue. Not gonna really speak too tough about it. It's got the applicator. <laughs> you guys know how to do that. Anywho, let's talk about my Old Faithful. If I can take it out the box. I told y'all I'm gonna be out here in these streets. Well, on the sidewalk. So we gotta lock in the makeup. We have the Charlotte Tilbury Airbrush spray setting spray and the one size on till dawn spray um this one i just kind of refresh my makeup this one i use to like lock it in set it in the way my sweat be set up sometimes i feel like these don't be working but um i'm still keep <laughs> because it definitely betrayed me when i tried to go to my um my homegirl's birthday party and I was sweating like a hooker. I also wanted to try Vanessa Myrick's a yummy, yummy, yummy skin tint. I got the shade number nine and I have been using um, House Labs foundation. I really do like that foundation, but the girl's been talking about this one. So I was like, all right, let's, let's try to get this one and see how she goes. How do you open her though? Oh my God, that perfume smells so good. Every time I get a travel size fragrance, I'm like, oh, I wanna get the big one. I'm lying. But it's just like, oh, that one, I, I think I should've got the full bottle. But this is the packaging. You know what? We're just gonna dab a little one right now. Ooh, 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 I don't like how you came out, sir. Mm -mm. Let's give her a shaky shake shake. Live demos, look at me, huh, I'm a beauty influencer. Again. <laughs> Again. <laughs> Sorry guys, I'm a little delirious. Shit, does that look, that doesn't look like a little too light. But the problem is Sephora's lighting. <laughs> Between Sephora's lighting and then my face being a little bit darker than my chest, I don't be knowing what color to get. <laughs> But I want I want to have the experience where I just swipe some ish on my face and it's like gone. It's like, oh my God, it's not there. I mean, let's get into it. It's a little light. It's a little fucking light. We'll see. That's what return policies are for, darling. I'm, uh, I feel so bad for people in the UK. Like, damn. Like... Who was it? Abby and uh, Coco Peps. Shout out to y'all. Um, yeah, they be saying they they say that you can't return things, and I'm like. Ugh.
You know how much shit I would have if I couldn't return it? Oh, blasphemy. This is Anastasia's velvet. Oh my God, I, girl, you can't even read straight. This is Anastasia's lip velvet. I got the shade Crush. And there's this one girl on TikTok. When I tell you gorgeous freaking makeup, just absolutely sublime. So um, yeah, I haven't purchased anything from Anastasia since like forever. <laughs> but I thought this was a really, really pretty shade. And uh -huh. I kind of. Now, obviously, I don't have a lip liner on, so it doesn't look fantastic at all, but yeah. <laughs> Put a lip liner on, you can figure it out. I could have sworn this was lighter, though. It feels really, really nice, especially with the topicals under it, but yeah. Maybe I'm gonna take that off, because <laughs> I can't sit through this whole video with that lipstick on me. Yeah. But the last thing I got was from Fenty Beauty. Now, everyone keeps talking about that reddish color, fruit snack, was it fruit snacks? I don't even know what color. Y'all can have that, y'all can have that. But the color I'm after, sweet mouth. Listen, first of all, I didn't realize that they made this in a full size because one of their holiday sets Yo, they had banger after banger after banger. That wasn't too smart to put lip. You know what? I'm gonna come right back. So Sweet Mouth was in one of those holiday sets. I did grab them. We're gonna talk about it a little later. But it's this really, really pretty light pink with this shimmer in it. It's silver shimmer. Usually I'm not a silvery kind of girl, but on the lips, I'll allow it. And it was something about this color, not too shabby, not too crazy. I love this color, but if there's anyone from Fenty who is watching this, I beg of you, bring back these two colors. This is Baby Brute and Cake Shake. When I tell you I love these shades, listen, come on camera, we need to report live. Like, this is such a really pretty, like, kind of milky pink. But Cake, Cake Shake, is a beautiful brown with silver reflex in it. This is holding on to dear freaking life. But look, 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 look. Focus. Look at this color. I don't even know why I put that on, but Fenty, please bring this one in a full size. Like, I don't know what I gotta do. Like, Rihanna ain't working on no damn album. So if you go and work on this, please, just, just bring this, just bring this one back. Like, out of all of them, I, I don't care about all the fun ones. Oh my gosh, y'all can have that. Like, I don't care about all that fun stuff anymore. But Cake Shake? was like the best brownish kind of pink with the silver. Like, I don't want that gold shimmer shit. I want this silver one. So please, for me, bring it back. But you know, Baby Brute is more like a light, light, creamy pink. And that's why I really did like it. But I'm gonna just hold them side by side. You see that? You see, like, it's just the, the, the touch. <sighs> like that, that, that's that. <sighs> Fenty, hook a girl up, please. Like, even if y'all don't wanna bring it back, just send me some. My PO box is in the description box. Just send it to me. I, don't, I won't even tell nobody. I won't tell anybody. I won't tell a soul. Just bring that back. I know you got, got it in the stash. I know you do. But if you renamed it, let me know, please. Y'all good for renaming some shit. So that's the end of this haul. Check out some other videos and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye.